Hey my muñecas, so today I thought I would do a shoe review on this shoe that you guys have seen me mention in previous videos and the reason why I wanted to do this review is because I have seen many reviews on this brand but I have yet to see a review on the shoe and I'm like I have this shoe, I love this shoe and I wanted to share it with you guys. So as you can see right here the shoe is by Ego and Greed. The reason why I have the box right here is because I want to show you guys what the what the shoe came in. And sometimes I think of that too because you never know. There are certain shoes that actually come in kind of fancy. Like they'll be in a dust bag or the way the box looks or something. But as you can see, it's a very ordinary shoe box. I do like to keep my shoes in a shoe box because right now my closet has no proper shoe shelf. So, of course, I keep them in their boxes. Their little homes, as I say. So the shoe that I'm showing with you guys today and sharing with you guys and reviewing with you guys is a shoe that I had mentioned in my uh, introduction slash birthday haul, which I believe was my very first video here on my channel. And the shoe that I'm sharing with you guys is the one and only Jenny shoe by Ego Ingrid. So here she is. Dun, da, da, da. This is the Jenny Shoe by Ego and Greed. I am so I am so happy to be the owner of this spectacular, crafty, and well-made creative shoe. The shoe comes in three different colors. Uh, as you can see, I have the regular uh, leather one. I believe this is fake leather, so like leather. Um, uh, with just the uh, brown wood. There is also one with uh, leopard print and another one with just plain black and it has um, black wood so it's all like darker but I got these because one they just you know they they're fun they go with pretty much everything that I already own and they can go with a multitude of other colors other than you know if you get the all black one um, that could go with everything, but I think it's mainly because of detail. You have to keep eye on detail, because details you also have to match as well. And this goes, this type of detail of the shoe with the brown wood goes with a multitude of colors and styles. And this shoe, I have to say, I love so very much, so very, very much. They are comfortable to walk in. The uh, product itself is very comfortable. And like I always make sure to tell you guys, I myself have a wide foot. I have kind of what we call the boxy feet. I have a wide foot. So I do, um, I do get my size, which is a size 7 in shoe. And um, it always works very well for me. And this shoe is very comfortable for my wide feet. Um, very uh, true to size basically that's all I gotta say is very true to size I love this shoe so much the height is amazing and a lot of people are scared of the shoe because of the height now let me tell you I was a little bit intimidated by it as well but I kept looking at it and was more and more fascinated with how it was created it is a 10 inch heel with a 6 inch platform and let me tell you it might look intimidating but these are so worth to have, especially if you are an everyday heel wearer. If you don't wear heels that often, these are not the shoes for you. Uh, these are more for someone who is so used to the balance of heels, especially platforms like myself. Most of my shoes are actually platforms. I am obsessed with platform shoes. And that is to pretty much uh, accommodate for my Napoleon complex because I am 5'1". <laughs> So, um, I just love these shoes, and I want to share these shoes with you guys. They are absolutely gorgeous. I have both of them right here. They're absolutely gorgeous. They're so beautiful, well-made. I mean, the comfort of these. It's so soft on the inside right here. It's, it's unbelievably soft. I, I love these, but I am going to give you the warning of these shoes. Um, make sure if you ever wear these out and not just when you have like a simple house party, make sure you go somewhere where is it, it where it is a designated heel area. 
that's what I call. I call it a designated heel area, meaning it is flat enough for you to be wearing platforms or any kind of a heel as high as these, such as. So anytime you guys want to go out somewhere and you want to wear your best platforms, make sure it is a platform designated area. Because if it is not, do not wear your platforms and especially if you are buying these lovelies. I'm a huge fan of Ego and Greed. I hope um, I soon to be a owner of another pair from them. These are the only pair I have so far from them, sadly. But I am so obsessed with these shoes. I'm so glad that I got these. And I got them on sale. I got these babies from ashberrysky.com. Uh, and I love that store. They have reasonable pricing. The shipping is always prompt. I, I, I'm so in love with how amazing that store is. And not only that, but they, the tracking system, the packaging system, everything. This is the um, second time, I believe, that I've gotten shoes from Ashberry. The first time I got um, basically a bargain in my eyesight, a bargain, a two for one basic deal. I got two uh, shoes from the brand YRU. And um, basically, I was just astonished by these. These were a birthday present. These were a gift from my mama, from my mother. Um, she knows how obsessed I am with shoes and platforms, and she, she overdid herself and surprised me with the ultimate, ultimate, ultimate platforms. And um, when I saw where the box was from, Ashbury Skies, I was like, oh my gosh, you know, a mixture of the two, my favorite, or a mixture of the three, shoes, platforms, and one of my favorite shoe stories online. guys want to get these beauties I believe they are still up on the store and I am not being told to promote them they are not paying me for this they don't they probably don't even know I exist but I am letting you guys know that that is where I got my shoes and I honestly love that store I love how prompt their shipping is I love how amazing their prices are usually they always have sales and us shoe lovers we love a good sale so I want to share these shoes with you guys I hope you guys enjoyed um, if you guys want to know more about just anything through my everyday videos I always ask you guys would you guys like me to do a ooh, excuse me <clears throat> I hope I'm not getting sick a where did I get this video where did I get that video or even how I do certain makeup style videos like in an earlier video, I did a um, certain kind of a ombre-ish uh, lipstick kind of style, which I do know a lot of girls, you know, everybody has a different technique and you want to learn different techniques of how to do it because they, they don't always look the same or come out the same. Um, I remember a friend of mine when I had shown her my video, she asked me how she did that how she or how I did that I mean <laughs> excuse me she asked how I did that how I did the ombre lips with my lipstick and the fact that she asked me was awesome so I'm asking you guys if you would love to comment below what would you like to see would you guys like to see a um, certain kind of makeup haul would you guys like to, me to do a what's in my makeup box video I would love to do that for you guys just let me know in the comments below thumbs up subscribe uh, and share this video with fellow other fashionistas makeup lovers anybody so if you guys have any questions about anything of 
uh, coming up videos. I would love, 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 love to do a Q&A for you guys, but I need questions. So you guys leave your questions down below and I will be more than happy to let you guys know about a future Q&A. So thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed today's shoe review because I know I enjoy these shoes. So I'm going to put a link down below of where I got them. And I hope you guys have a great day. I love you, my muñecas.